Hello everybody and welcome back to In Your Face Studios and another episode of Unboxing. This one is a food unboxing. Your favorites? Yes. Yes, her favorite. <laughs> and we got something. Now we were watching uh, Shark Tank um, recently and we um, a lot of times you see things on there and you think that's pretty cool. I'd like to pick that up. When we saw this, we were like, that ah, looks pretty cool. It's pretty cool. But then we started thinking it looks really good and as more we watched it, the more we fell in love with the concept and we thought, well, is it good or isn't it? We got to try it. And the sharks seem to really like it too, so... That even, was... though they, even though they all went out. Yes, but still, <laughs> they all liked but it. But they did get an offer from Lori. Yes. And so anyway, uh, let's, so let's check it out. What is it? What could it possibly be? See the cute little face there and we got... it's. The pizza cupcake. So we ordered it. Um, it was supposed to be delivered like in, I think it said five business days or something like that, which is like a week. But, and it doesn't say anything until I ordered it. As soon as I ordered it, then I got a, a, a like an email later saying, um, thank you for your order and uh, we'll send you tracking numbers. But just so you know, um, because of the because of the uh, Shark Tank episode. The demand. Shipping, what? The demand was Oh, really the demand, high. I thought you said it was banned. No. <laughs> it was banned. No, yeah, the demand was so high that they, it was, uh, the shipping was behind. So it, instead of taking us about a week, it took us about, um, I don't know, like three weeks? Has it been three weeks? I was gonna say Maybe. about two weeks. Yeah, two or three weeks to yeah. get this, but that's fine. We weren't, we're not like in a rush. As you can see, um, you know, I'm not wasting away. It's not like I'm starving and I gotta have some food. But um, yeah, so we ordered that. We ordered this, and um, it's from um, it's from New York. It comes from New York. I don't know if it says exactly. Well, I don't know because this says it's Bullhead City, Arizona. So if you watch the episode, they did say they figured out their co-packer. So maybe that's where their their co-packer for this is now. But um, the company is in New York. The, the gentleman who came up with the idea is from Italy. That's why I'm wearing the, the Italy shirt from Rome. He's from Italy. He moved to London uh, to study uh, the culinary arts. Then he, when he came to New York, he met uh, his future wife. They were having a dinner. I guess their first date was out to pizza. It's a good date. What do we have for our first date? What do we eat? I think we ate at Chili's. No, I think it was Red Robin. Oh, maybe. I think it was Red Robin in Moreno Valley. I would yeah. rather have pizza. I think it was Red Robin, Moreno Valley, next to the, the movie theater yeah. that we went to out there. But, um, yeah, so they they out there, and she talked him into quitting uh, the jobs he had and concentrate on the pizza cupcake. And we say thank you to her for getting him to do that because now we get to try it. Well, I don't know if I should thank him until we eat it because yeah, what if it's not good? I don't know. But I've heard, I've heard, good. I've, all I've heard is good things about it. So let's, uh, yeah, I let's, like the uh, logo. correct it. Yeah, it's cute. They even got, you can see the right here. Let's see if I can get that. He's right there. See that? That's the little guy. And they even have like a, a suit, like a mascot yeah, suit. suit. It didn't look like a cupcake at first. Well, it doesn't yeah. look like a cupcake at all. That's what they call it. But he looked like a, he looked like a bowl of something, but yeah. then you realize it's the bread. Yeah. So um, you can go to the pizzacupcake.com and order this. Man, I gotta be careful. <laughs> All right, there we go. And then, so, <laughs> so when, look at it. Now watch this. So we, we open the box, could open the box, and you open it, and there he is again. <laughs> so they got their stuff together when it comes to marketing. This is all stuff that they had. Um, they already had all this planned out and put together before they even went on shark tanks. They had all their stuff together. Yeah. Uh, they were just looking for a high profile shark to, um, you know, get the get the name out there more. I think that's pretty much what it is. Um, so let's see what we got here. We're gonna open that up. And then we got, whoop, fill out. So we got this here and it says, I'm freezing, wanna warm me up? And he's, he's winking there. He, I don't know if you can see that. And it says, Hey, look who's finally here. <laughs> Aren't you the lucky one? A box full of me just for you. Well, I hope you don't mind sharing. But first, let me tell you a few tips so you can turn me on just right in the oven. Let's go. 
A lot of double entendres yes, there. Very sexual. <laughs> Don't read this in front of your, your kids. <laughs> what do you mean, turn me on, Daddy? <laughs> Uh, no, don't worry about it. We're going to have pizza cupcakes. Just shut up, go in the other room till it's done. <laughs> um, tip number one, store me in the freezer, not the refrigerator. Cool. Um, we're not going to really store, we did store them in the refrigerator when we got it. Um, just for now, because we're going to eat them all. We're not putting them in the freezer, eating them later. <laughs> uh, tip two, the heating instructions in this package are for baking from frozen to oven. Pro tip, and I knew this already, thaw the pizza cupcakes for one hour prior to baking, then bake me for eight to 10 minutes. And I already knew that. That's why I didn't mind storing them in the refrigerator because I knew we were gonna let them thaw out anyway to um, get them nice and crispy. I think they're crispy. Cause I've, I've heard when you bite them, they're like, you get a little crunch. So, and if I'm trying to remember, did he say it was kind of a cross between um, pizza dough and brioche yes if i remember yeah. right, he says so it's a so it's you know it's not your it's not going to be a thick I'm hard like maybe crust. like a garlic knot maybe like a <laughs> garlic knot yeah I don't know. so we got this here we got and here then um let's see this is just the invoice we don't need that all right let's take this off here we'll open that up let me get yeah. up here if this is a good video because this is a good time for me not to wear pajamas in the video, which I usually do. When you see me in my videos, I'm sitting there, I'm usually wearing pajamas. So we open that up. We got here, and look, there's an, another, little, another little smiley face. You put your fingers in to pull the box up. There we go. I'm gonna throw all this on the ground. We'll have, uh, we'll have our son clean that up later. So we got here, here they come. There's the box and the box. And yeah, so it's uh, pretty cool. It's just insulated. It's not, it's not like the ones that you get would have, would, that have the dry ice. Uh, luckily, I was here when it came in the morning and um, got, got to put it away because I think if you get this and it sits out all day, <laughs> I don't know how that's gonna work. But yeah, so we got the, there you go, the, the pizza cupcake box. It's, um, how many are in each box? 12. There's 12. Oh, maybe we won't eat them all. <laughs> no, I know. I, for some reason, I thought there was only six in a box. No, we so, ordered the Shark Tank special, remember? No, I know, but I thought there was only six in each of these oh, little boxes. No. Well, I guess um, we will be putting these in the freezer. They still seem frozen. Yeah. Um, it says, uh, um, <laughs> the little guy saying, Mom and Dad. So this is the story. It says, the story behind every bite. We're a family-owned small business founded by a husband and wife from two sides of the world, Italy and New York. It's our trade secret dough recipe that makes the pizza cupcake unique. But it's our true love for good ethical food. Ethical food? Is mm -hmm. there food that's not ethical? Yeah, I'm sure that has hormones. and. Oh, okay. I was thinking like there was a... You know, like a slice of pizza out there, you know, like, like committing crime or something or like <laughs> tricking people into to, to bad deal, bad business deals. Yeah, everybody wants okay. healthy. Uh, yeah. Ethical food that turns the experience of buying into something so delicious, so special. And we're proud to bake each carefully crafted pizza cupcake in Brooklyn, New York, while sourcing recyclable materials for all the packaging in our hands. So I don't know why... The box said it was from, what did it say, Nevada? Arizona. Arizona? I don't know why it says it's from Arizona, but they shipped them there. maybe they packaged these. Maybe they packaged these in New York just like they say, and then they ship out these boxes in bulk to different warehouses. Probably cheaper. Right? And then they send them out. Yeah. Something like that. But, um, yeah, so, um, so what we're going to do, we're going to let these sit out for an hour. And we're gonna patiently wait, and then uh, we're gonna heat them up and give them a try. Okay, so we got our special pizza pan here that we use, and we got the cup, the pizza cupcakes. Let's go ahead and get those there. They're packaged up. Oh, yeah, they're in a little it's plastic fine. little. Looks like it's a Ziploc. Yeah. So I'm gonna go ahead and rip that out. You washed your hands, right? Yes. <laughs> so 
so they're yeah it's just little dough and the cheese is in there and then they put a pepperoni there's a couple pepperonis actually like oh look at that there you go see and a couple pepperonis right there oops gonna put those back in there i washed my hands too so we got those oh and that's that's the preheating bell it's ready to go it's time to put them in the oven we're gonna take these over here Get it ready for the oven. Ooh, there they go. Put them in there. All right, close it up. And we said for how long did they say? 10 to 12 minutes. 10 to 12 minutes. So I'm going to do 12 minutes because I would like them nice and well done. Oh, it's getting close. It's getting close. 10, Nine, 9, 8, 7, 6, 6 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. I have to do that sound. All right, let's turn that off. Turn it off. Here we go. Ooh, look at the pizza. Ooh, look at that. Oh, my gosh. Look at that. I can... Ooh. You can see the grease like bubbling up top. Get it close for that. Can you see the grease in there? Bubbling the cheese. All right, so we're gonna grab a couple of these here. Get them on the plate. Uh, I want the one with the crispy pepper. Ooh, you can. Did you hear that? Ooh. There we go. Uh, eat that one there. All right. Here, and let me take that off. Now I know why these are these are been recalled because it that was I could feel the heat from the pizza pan through the infinity gauntlet. All right, here we go. There they are, hot, steaming right out of the oven. Let's get a whiff of that. What do you think? Good. Yeah. Smells really good. You can sm obviously when you cook pizza, any kind of Italian food, and you cook it in the house, you can fills the house full of um, wonderful aromatic aromas. Aromas, isn't that the same thing? Aromatic aromas. Maybe. Anyway, it smells really. It smells <laughs> really good. <laughs> All right. Um, here we go. Boom. Thank you. Uh, I want this one with the burned pepperoni. So that there, and we're gonna. I'm gonna cut mine open here to see if we can get a move this plate out of the way. And we'll get to see if we can get a close up of that here. I'm gonna stick my oh you can hear that, hear that. And we're just gonna cut it right down the middle. So we've got the reveal. Oh nice, look at that. It's got cheese and it's got sauce. In there, the sauce is in there, and then they put the cheese on top. So, got that here. From, you wanna, are you gonna cut yours? Yeah, or are you gonna, I think so. Just take a bite. I'm gonna cut it for right now. Right. You got two pepperonis. See, some of them have two, some only have one. This one only has one. So, you wanna go first? See, that's good. You get a pepperoni on each bite. I, yeah. I have a pepperoni on this bite, but not a pepperoni on this bite. Right? Together. Together? Okay. Yeah. Ready? One, two, three. Mm. Oh. That good. is really good. It tastes like pepperoni pizza. The cheese, the sauce, the pepperoni. It's no, that doesn't, nothing stands out to me on that, but the bread, it is like a, like a flaky garlic knot, you know? Yeah, it's kind of like a dinner roll in a way. Mm, I don't know, like a dinner roll, because it's not dense. It's very no. light. It's like a, like you know what, like a dinner croissant. You know what I mean? Like the flakiness Maybe, of yeah. the croissant when you when you get the like the Pillsbury croissants, but it's even lighter than that. It's even flake, like not flaky, but you can see. I think you said something with yeah. the brioche and you kind of get that feel, I guess. 
Ja. Hallo, Jim. And if you watched our other videos on the Coke Pepsi challenge, I mentioned I don't really care for Coke or Pepsi, but with pizza, besides beer, there's no better drink than a, a nice icy cold Coca-Cola with pizza. That's when I drink Coke is usually if we get pizza, I'll get a Coke. Oh, the bread's really light. Very light. Mm -hmm. It's so light, I think you could eat about six of these by yourself and you'd be fine. Is that what you're gonna I try? Think, I think that's. I think it'd be okay. <laughs> you're justifying it. Huh? Yeah, it's not heavy. <laughs> I don't know what the. I don't know what the calories are on it. Did you look? Yeah. What is it? Uh, two are 330 calories. Is that good or bad? I don't know. That's pretty good. I mean, it's. What's like a slice a, of pizza? It's 165 calories a. Well, that depends on what pizza Okay, what about get. when you get Blaze? What's the what's the calories on a Blaze pizza average? Uh, about seven, eight hundred. I was going to say, I thought, it was, I thought it was 800. The regular crust. That's yeah. the regular crust. Mm -hmm. I thought it was like 800. So this is how much? 330. For, for two. two. Uh-huh. So. It's 165 each. So 330. So two of them would be six something? Seven, seven, eight, nine. So four of them would be less than a Blaze pizza? Right? Yeah. So you need four of these instead of getting the Blaze pizza. <laughs> I mean, it's a good... I'd probably get stuck at the Blaze be a, pizza. it's a good snack. It is. You know, it would be a good... You um, know, after school. Uh, after school snack or party. Yeah, party. You have, um, you have, you have these out? Mm -hmm. So I'm going to just take a, a straight up bite here from... And let's see what happens here. Mmm. Mmm. <laughs> yeah. That's what I was looking for. The cheese pull. Look at that. Oh, look at that. I'm going to put it back in there. So you got it. Mm -hmm. You got another one with two pepperonis. Mm -hmm. And I still got the one. So that's the only thing I would say. Um, the Pizza Cupcake Company. Oh. You're going to put two pepperonis in them. Yeah. Put two pepperonis in every one of them. They probably do, but... You know, that's their plan, but sometimes it doesn't always happen. And we cook these on a, a special uh, a pizza tray we have that has holes so that you can see how it comes through and it crisps the bottom. Mm -hmm. I don't know if cooking it on a cookie sheet changes that. I don't think it said put it on a cookie sheet or put it on the rack. You can't put them on the rack. It said put it on a cookie sheet. No. So, I don't know if that will change the texture of the bottom, but we got nice brown and crispy um the bottom from the heat not from the cookie sheet maybe the cookie sheet would make it crispier i don't know probably but either way even if you have like some people use a pizza stone yeah i like this a lot i'm really glad we bought it i'll probably i definitely will buy some more i was gonna say probably but i definitely will order some more not all the time not right away because we still have an um Another box, we made uh, six of them right now. Mm -hmm. We're doing this on camera, off camera. Even before we tried them, the first bite went to our son. He liked it. Yeah. You liked it? Yeah. See, so he said, yeah. Could you hear him? Say it louder. Yes. There you go. So <laughs> he liked it. Um, if you can, uh, you know, if a 19-year-old you know, likes it and doesn't just say, it's all right. Because a lot of times you give him something and he's like, it's okay. I'll, I'll cook something and I'll say, if you like it, and he says he likes it. And then I said, did you like it better than the last time I made it? He goes, I don't remember. Or at least if you don't get a, it's fine. It's fine. <laughs> no, these are really good. Good. Like I said, it's not something I would get all the time. They're not cheap. No. But it's an indulgence, and it's cool. It's really good. Um, we, um... We we made six. We made six. six. And we have another six. We're gonna pop in the oven <laughs> right after we're done with this, and we'll eat those again. Um, the other twelve are um, the other twelve are in our um, freezer. We'll save those. Like like if somebody we really like comes over, we'll share it. So if you're one of my friends and you come over <laughs> and uh, you don't get the um, 
Pizza cupcakes? What can I say? You're not in the top tier, apparently. You're not, you're not in the top <laughs> tier. You know, and if you do get the cupcakes, there you go. So, all right. Um, so, you want to um, give it a review out of, what would we say, five out of five stars? Yeah. You know? Sure. So, uh, I'll count to three, and then you just hold up. How many stars do you want to give it? Okay. I think uh, Ambrose and I did that when we were doing the wrestling. So we'll do that for this. So on a count of three, one, two, three, four. Four? Yeah. Hey, we'll give it a four. Because <laughs> it's, you know, it's, it's a great concept, right? It's a great concept. Um, the, 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 I was going to say the mozzarella. The mozzarella, as we say. You know, you say mozzarella. I call you on it. It's mozzarella. You get the, the mozzarella, the, the sauce, and the pepperoni. It's just good. The sauce doesn't stand out to me as being some great no. sauce. It just, it's good pizza sauce, good pepperoni, um, uh, mozzarella cheese. The bread is the kicker, and it comes in that little compact little cupcake. Mm -hmm. um, now, if you, if you gave me this and you said, here's a slice of pizza, eh, I'd be, it's okay. Yeah. You know, it's okay, but um, the, the concept, the, the bread... Yeah, it's like a, like I said, like it's like a croissant kind of crusty, and you get you, like when the when the croissant flakes off, or like certain kinds of biscuits, like you were saying, or dinner roll, mm -hmm. certain kinds of like real flaky ones. I mean, that's, way, way better, but I'm just yeah, saying. it's a lot better. I'm, that's what the, and they say it in their in their they said it on their thing. Their their hook is their the bread, crust, the dough. their 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 dough, mm -hmm. and yeah. I, I really did. Yeah, if it wasn't for the dough, I. In medium to two and a half, yeah. you know, like mid mid range, but it goes up a little higher um, there because of the because of the dough. It's really good. Um, the only thing that keeps it from a five is I've had pizza in Rome, <laughs> in Italy. You've had pizza in Italy. It that's cost. that's a lot of that's a lot of yeah. You know, maybe the cost that's costed for you brought it yeah. down a little bit. Um, yeah, it's really good. It's really good. Uh, four is not bad. No, it's good. That's really good. That's better than average. Um, I want to eat it again. It's, Come on. it's not a. It's not perfect. It's not a perfect. Uh, yeah. Uh, pizza, but it's it's really good. I think it's really good. I fully endorse it. Two thumbs up. And um, yeah, I think if you want to give it a shot, uh, go to the pizzacupcake.com. Uh, try it out. Um, I have no special code for you or anything. <laughs> they didn't like send me these. That'd be nice if they did. But, I know. Um, <laughs> but yeah, that was really good. So thanks for watching the video. We hope you enjoyed it. We hope you had some fun. Um, make sure you like the video. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. So get your friends to subscribe too. Tell everybody you know. Tell them In Your Face Studios on YouTube is a fun channel and that they should subscribe. We got lots of videos for you. So um, thanks for watching. Um, Say bye. 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 <laughs> Have fun. And I'll see you soon. All right. Second batch. <laughs> what was your what was your favorite thing about it? Was it the cheese or the was it the bread? The bread. Probably the bread. <laughs>